It has now been 10 years since the Tucson Padres left for El Paso. Its absence made Tucson one of the nation's largest cities with no affiliated minor league baseball. And it was part of a one two punch as it happened not long after spring training left for Maricopa County. But as I recently found out, one bill and a few dedicated community leaders are fighting to bring baseball back. It's a routine Tucson Saguaro's Pecos League home game, and there's barely anyone in the Kino Stadium stands for a game against the Austin Weirdos. It bothers me. I mean, I'm one of the people who loves AAA baseball. Mike Fader was a longtime Tucson Minor League Baseball general manager. From the Tucson Toros championship heyday. Nothing was better than the 90s at High Corbin Field. I mean, it was electric and there was life. To the three years, the lame duck Tucson Padres were last in the Pacific Coast League in attendance. We were only supposed to be here one year. The problem Fader points to is an outdated Kino Stadium. When you see the stadiums that are out there right now, the AAA stadiums, they're beautiful. That includes a $114 million minor league ballpark coming to Knoxville, Tennessee. And he says it's AAA or Pecos League with no in-between. Geographically, Tucson doesn't fit in the AA Texas League or the single-A California League, leaving Tucson caught looking. Enter the recently created Southern Arizona Sports, Tourism and Film Authority, intended to bring events and possibly even teams back to Tucson in order to help the economy. We all felt the loss of spring training. People lost jobs, they lost opportunities. Pima College Vice President Edgar Soto is the chair of this new Southern Arizona Sports, Film and Tourism Authority. It was created from Senate Bill 1710 and is expected to work with six local counties and three tribal nations. I'm actually really excited right now because I think there is some possibility for professional baseball. Soto is working on bringing back spring training baseball through International League play next year. But as for AAA baseball, in my opinion, you need a new stadium. Soto isn't so sure if, for example, the future Las Vegas A's need a AAA home that seats 11,000 fans. I think this is still a viable option for them. But Soto says thanks to SB 1710, anything is now possible, even a new stadium. He'd love to hit a home run, just one with more people watching. We've got to be in a place where, you know, that these being creative, being excited, and, and looking at what these teams actually want. And so I think we'll be in a good spot here soon.